Hey guys, once again, Tinubu lands in France for medical reasons as presidency keeps mute on his whereabouts since World Economic Forum ended on Monday in Saudi Arabia. The president's trip to France came a few days after his trip to Saudi Arabia, officially ended following the conclusion of the World Economic Forum. Okay, in Saudi Arabia, investigation by Sarah reporters shows that the president first went to London, England, from Saudi Arabia on Tuesday and then left the UK for France on Thursday. Nigerian's president Bola Tinubu has gone to France. Sahara reporters has gathered. The president's trip to France came a few days after his trip to Saudi Arabia officially ended following the conclusion of the World Economic Forum on Monday. Investigation by Sahara reporters shows that the president first went to London, England, from Saudi Arabia on Tuesday and then left the UK for France on Thursday. While the presidency has been silent on the trip to the UK from Saudi Arabia and later to France, Sahara reporters was told that the president's unreported trip to France was for medical reasons. The president is in France to see his doctors, a source said. An investigation by Sahara reporters revealed that a Nigerian presidential aircraft, okay, a gloss trim, uh, aerospace GVSP G550 with registration number 59. FGW and serial number 5310 mode X 0640 F2 with Tunubu on board arrived at uh, Paris Airport Le Boquet, France around 400 pm on Thursday from an airport in London. The president on Tuesday morning left Saudi Arabia where he attended the World Economic Forum for London. A statement issued that uh, last week by the Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, Ajiri Garali, he said the Special WEF meeting in, in Riyadh uh, would end on Monday, April 29. After his engagement in the Netherlands, President Tinubu will proceed to attend a special World Economic Forum, WEF meeting, scheduled for April 28 to 29, okay, in Saudi Arabia, the statement had read. Meanwhile, in the statement, the presidency carefully left out information about when Tinubu was expected back in Nigeria after the International Forum or that he would visit the UK and France after leaving Saudi Arabia. Also, the presidency has been silent on President Tinubu's whereabouts since the international summit ended on Monday, April 29. Efforts to reach Mr. Bayo Nonoga, the special advisor to the president on information and strategy for comments and clarification failed as he did not answer calls from our correspondent. He also did not reply to messages sent to his mobile phone. However, Sahara reporters learned that the 5NFGW, that is Glue String Aerospace, which was operated as Nigerian Air Force One, meaning the president was on board, left Saudi Arabia International Airport on Tuesday, April 30, at 12.05 a.m., 0205 a.m. Saudi Arabian time and arrived at uh, Stans Airport, London at 6.35 a.m. UK time. The jet was used to replace the Boring Business Jet, Boring 737-7005N MGT that is still in, in German for repair, Germany for repairs. Nigerian Air Force One is not te technically the plane, it's simply the radio call 
name for any Nigerian Air Force jet carrying the president of Nigeria. As soon as the president stepped abroad, an Air Force jet, either the Boring Business Jet or Boring R737-700059, and FGT or Gulfstream Air Space GV SP G550 with registration number N5N FGW or the FACOM 7X jet. Okay, that aircraft is referred to as Nigerian Air Force One by the crew and all air traffic controllers in order to avoid confusion with any other planes in the area and give him special treatment. No plane can operate as Nigerian Air Force One without the president on board. It is an illegal and treasonable offense. So, f so far it is to be operated as an uh, Nigerian Air Force uh, 01 to London, as you stated clearly, should President Tunubu was on board. If you check the flight history of the correspondent, the current plane in London, you would realize it was operated recently as Nigerian Air Force 2, meaning that the Vice President Shetima was the one on board, a senior Nigerian Air Force officer had told Sahara reporters. Before the 2023 general elections, Tunubu's health was a source of concern for many Nigerians. Sahara reporters had reported how the former Lagos governor spent over four months uh, patronizing hospitals in France, the United States, and the United Kingdom, where he underwent several surgeries between 2020 and 2024. He was flown out of the country same day before Christmas in 2020 to Paris, uh, France. The president returned to Nigeria on January 24, 2021, after a month absent from Nigeria. He also went for a medical checkup in France in June 2021 and was conspicuously absent from a one day working visit of then President Muhammad Buhari to Lagos State. Tunubu and Miss Dead Rumors was forced to return to the country on Tuesday, June 15, 2021. Sarah reporters also reported that Tunubu was hospitalized in Maryland. The United States, in July 2021, on August 9, the APC leader had another knee surgery as the, the Jones Hawkins, Hopkins University Hospital in Maryland, USA. The APC chieftain, it was Lance, left the U.S. for the United Kingdom on crutches a few days after the surgery. Sources close to Tinubu had told Sahara reporters that he wanted the surgery in Paris, France, but changed his plan over rumors of his death. In August, his predecessor, President Mohamed Wari, paid a visit to Tinubu in London, and the latter was seen with a, a walking stick during Buari's visit, confirming Sahara reporter's story that he had undergone surgery in the U.S. Upon his return in October 2022, Tunubu confirmed that he underwent surgery on his right knee as well as post-surgery physiotherapy on the said knee during his medical trip abroad. Sarah Report has also reported how the president, after the May 29, 2023, okay, swearing in, became exhausted and went on a bed rest. Sarah reporters also exclusively reported that Tinubu returned to France to see his daughters weeks before his inauguration on May 29. So guys, what's your take on this? Let's hear from you. Please drop your comments at the comment section. If you're just joining us, subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you.